What's up? Econ John here. In this video, we're going to talk about what wall rising and demand is. Let's go. What is wall rising and demand? No, whenever we're asked to find the demand for a good, we're looking for the quantity demanded by a consumer or a function we can use to obtain that amount. A wall rising demand, which is also called a Marshallian demand, represents how much a utility maximizing consumer should obtain considering income, price of the good, and price of another good, i.e. the wall rising or Marshallian demand for good one is x1 as a function of the price of good one price of good two and income m to find the wall rising or marshallian demands for good was one and two the problem we are always solving is to maximize our utility function subject to our budget constraint our lagrangian is our utility function as a function of good one and good two plus or minus lambda times income m minus the price of good one times the good one over here or the quantity of good one minus the price of good two times good two. So in terms of finding your wall rising demands, let's recap. Step number one, define your problem as maximizing utility function subject to your budget constraint. Your Lagrangian should be or your utility function plus or minus lambda times income M minus the price of good one times good one minus the price of good two times good two. The next step over here is to take the first or order partials and set them equal to zero. For example, like the partial derivative of our Lagrangian with respect to good one should be equal to, equal to zero. You should solve where the, each one of those are equal to zero for a good one, good two, and lambda. And then we solve as our third step for lambda star, x star, and x2 star. So x1 star and x2 star are your wall rising demands. We use lambda star in this context as a tool to find them. So that's how you find your wall rising demands. I hope this helps.